Hi guys, so today I am here with a new name video for you. This is going to be the next video in my unusual names for every letter of the alphabet and today we are going to be doing C names for boys. If you haven't seen the rest of the videos in this series, I will link them in the description box below, but I'm just going to get started with the C names for boys. The first name I have on this list is Cornelius. Cornelius is an ancient Latin name and means horn. It is a biblical name, a literary name. It appears in Shakespeare and in Harry Potter. And it was the name of many historical figures, including Cornelius Vanderbilt. This name was in the top 1000 until 2008. And it was even a top 200 name back in the 1800s. So it does have a bit of a vintage feel to it. However, this name is now number 1532 and was given to only 106 boys in 2017. The next name I have is Canyon. Canyon is a word name that definitely brings to mind images of the Grand Canyon and kind of the wonders of nature. It's definitely make a good choice for outdoorsy parents or if you're just looking for something a little different I think it would make a great alternative to Caden or Cameron or even Camden. Canyon was given to 113 boys in 2017 and ranked at number 1477. The next name is one that I have been really loving recently, and that is Callister. Callister is a super cool variation of the name McAllister and means son of Alistair. I think this would be a great choice if you're trying to honor an Alistair or if you have McAllisters in your family tree like I do. You might recognize this name if you are a fan of Black Mirror. Um, one of the episodes, in fact, my favorite episode is called the USS Callister. This name was only given to 10 boys in the US in 2017. The next name I have is Cassian. Cassian is a variation of the Latin family name Cassius and it has recently gained popularity because of Star Wars hero Cassian Andor. There have been four saints with the name Cassian, at least four, and cast names are just super hot right now. Caspian entered the top 100 in 2017. Cassian isn't quite as popular as Caspian. It's ranked number 1371 and was given to 128 boys in 2017. The next name I have is Calloway. Calloway is a great Irish surname and it has kind of a naturey meaning. It means pebbly place. So I think that would be a really fun naturey kind of tie and it fits in with other Irish names, Irish surname names like Sullivan and Finnegan and you could get the nickname Cal and even honor a Calvin. This name was only given to 43 boys in 2017 and I feel like it would make a great choice if you have Irish ancestry. The next name I have is Cypress. This is the name of the Cypress tree and it would fit in with other cool tree names like Ash and Willow. The nickname Cy also makes this name more accessible and appealing. It was given to only 35 boys in 2017. And then there is the similar sounding Cyprus as in the Mediterranean island. And I think that would be a cool place name choice, especially with, for parents with the Iberian heritage. And the island name was given to only 16 boys in 2017. The next name I have is also a place name and that is Charleston. Charleston is the name of an American city and it really has a great American sound to it. It could also honor a Charles or a Charlie or even a Charlotte. 
and I feel like this name would be great if you have connections to South Carolina or you just want a really underused place name. Charleston was given to only 58 boys in 2017. The next name I have is Cortez. Cortez is a Spanish surname that means courteous. English and Irish surnames have been trendy for a while and I love to see that surnames from other languages are being used as well. Cortez has that trendy two syllable sound and that great Z ending and Cortez is just outside the top 1000 at number 1098 with 175 boys being given this name in 2017. The next name I have is Casimir. Casimir is a Polish or Slavic name and it's exotic but I feel like it's still accessible. Most people have heard this name before. It's been the name of Polish kings, a saint, literary characters, and with names like Caspian and Casper gaining popularity, I feel like Casimir is a more exotic alternative to some of those names. It was only given to 24 boys in the US in 2017. The next name I have is Carlisle. So Carlisle is a twilight name, but it's a lot less popular than some of the other twilight names have gotten. Almost all of the other twilight names, Emmett, Jasper, Alice, Rosalie, Esme, they've gone up so much in popularity. I feel like they're almost all top 500 names now, but Carlisle is nowhere near the top 1000. It has just such a soft masculine sound and it means from the walled city. And you have the option of the really adorable nickname Lyle. Carlisle is at number 2000. 945 and was only given to 40 boys in 2017. The next name I have is Courage. Courage is really the ultimate virtue name for boys. I feel like it makes a great middle name choice. I actually know a boy with this as a middle and I adore it. As a first name, I feel like Corey as a nickname can make it a little bit more accessible. Courage as a first name was only given to eight boys in 2017. Then I have Cerulean. Cerulean is such a cool color name and it just has the right feel to kind of become a boy's name. It ends with that Ian sound and it's a beautiful light blue color. This name has already been considered by some parents, was given to five boys in 2017, and I think it would also make a beautiful middle name choice, especially for a boy with blue eyes. The next name I have is Carrick. Carrick is a Gaelic name and means rock, but it's also a type of knot that's used in sailing. So I feel like this would be an interesting choice if you're looking for a very rare nautical sailing type name. It has a similar feel to more popular names like Maverick, Patrick, Kendrick because of that Rick ending. And it could also honor a Richard or any other Rick name. Carrick was given to 21 boys in 2017. The next name I have is Constantine. Constantine is a very grand and historical boy's name. I feel like 20 years ago it might have seemed too big, but now with the rise of boys' names like Ezekiel and Augustus and Leonardo and Santiago, Constantine doesn't feel like it's such a big name anymore. And this name could honor a Stan or a Stanley, which I think is a really cool way. I love when there's like sneaky little ways to honor people in a name. Constantine means steadfast, and it was the name of the first Roman emperor to convert to Christianity, as well as the name of several Scottish kings. Constantine was given to 99 boys in 2017 and is ranked at 1,605. 
And finally, the last name I have on this list is Cove. Cove is such a handsome nature name. and It's starting to gain some attention. I feel like it's kind of a brother name to names like Harbor and Isla. Cove would be such a great one syllable middle name choice for a longer first name. It was given to 50 boys in 2017 and the similar sounding coast is another unique nature name choice for parents looking for kind of a beachy vibe and coast was given to only 12 boys in 2017. So let me know what your favorites were from that list and what your favorite sea names are for boys. Mine is obviously Caspian, my favorite name, and my brother's name, Caleb. And also, if you have any suggestions for D names that you would like me to feature, let me know in the comments below. Thank you guys so much for watching, and as always, I will talk to you later. Bye.